Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to another college day in my life. It is 8.05 a.m. I have an appointment at 10 a.m. at the Center of Academic Achievement, which is basically like the place where people go when they need some help. So I'm going to sit down with a tutor to help me with college algebra, but I'm going to school early today because I need to just sit in the library for like an hour and a half and just study before that appointment. So we're gonna do that. But before all of that, I'm gonna go to Target and I'm gonna get a binder so I can organize the notes for my chapters in college algebra. I think that that will help me because um, right now I just kind of, I don't know, I'm a little unorganized. I picked up a coffee while I was in Starbucks so I don't have to wait in the long line at school and I got some quad ruled paper dividers and a one inch binder so I can organize my college algebra notes. So it's 12:21, and I have not had lunch yet. I'm actually starving. I went to the library this morning. I did like a couple hours of studying. Then I went to my tutoring session. I actually spoke with the manager of all of the Center of Academic Achievement, and she's setting up something for me to get ongoing tutoring for college algebra, which is such a good thing because I really need something where I'm like every single week just getting that extra help because I suck at math. And yeah, we're not gonna get into that right now but I'm about to go have some lunch on campus and then keep studying and then I have a hair appointment at 2 30 and I'm so excited I'm getting my hair dyed a dark brown color and then I'm getting these dead ends trimmed um, and then I'm kind of debating on if I want to do like a balayage for fall like a little bit of uh, not like blonde highlighting but more like I guess more like orange toned I think it'll be really pretty for fall so we'll see but my appointments not till 2 30 so I'm gonna go eat lunch and study until then I'm at a red light right now, not driving and vlogging, just saying. But I uh, just picked up a smoothie really quick from Tropical Smoothie. I am heading to my hair appointment now. I went through my flashcards again and ate lunch in the library, which I don't even know if I was allowed to eat my lunch in the library, but no one said anything, so I did. I found some pictures that I really like, and I thought I'd show you guys like of what I'm gonna show my hairdresser when I go in there. This is not like exact. I mean, it's honestly like, I, I don't expect my hair to look exactly like this when I'm done, but these are kind of like my inspiration for what I want to do for fall. So this is my before. You can see it's very dead, lighter at the ends. Um, I don't want to lose really any of the length. I just want to take a little bit off the ends because they're just so, so dead. Update, I got my hair done. Here's the final product. I'm now in the car with Chad. We are heading to the melting pot to celebrate our five year anniversary. Um, but I didn't have a chance to update you guys because I literally just left the hair salon like 20 minutes ago and I had to rush home and change really fast to get ready for dinner. Um, cause we have a reservation at 6.45 and it's 6.20 so we're running a little behind. But look, it's really, really pretty. Um, let me take this off so you guys can actually see it. Here's what it looks like. I love it. It's very healthy. She cut a few inches off or probably just like one inch, but it feels like a lot because it's curled. So it's shorter. Now we're going to the melting pot. Are you excited? I am so excited. I've been looking forward to this dinner for months. Me too. And Chad got me flowers and I didn't even vlog it. And Norman loved chocolates, which are my absolute favorite. Um, and he also got me macaroons, which literally like my absolute favorite dessert ever is macaroons. And he got me macaroons from Norman Love, which I've never had Norman Love macaroons. So I'm so excited, but I had to rush out the door. So I hardly even got to look at them. Um, but thank you for that. I love you. You're very welcome. I'm so good. excited. We just made it back home. It's kind of late. We're gonna lay down and get some rest. I am so freaking tired. Here's my beautiful bouquet of flowers that Chad got for me. We got some chocolate covered strawberries from the melting pot. And what I'm most excited for, these macaroons. Look how big they are. These are like 
rather large in comparison to the other macaroons I've had in the past. If you're not already, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.